Here we have the Schlage BE 365 deadbolt, one of our favorite electronic budget style deadbolts. Now there's something real special about this deadbolt though. If I'm outside of the property and the house is locked and I hit the Schlage button, I can open this deadbolt without putting in any type of a user code or anything. Has this deadbolt malfunctioned? No, it's just installed incorrectly. We're gonna show you how to fix that. I'm Robert with Acme Locksmith and you're watching Locksmith Recommended. Now this Schlage electronic deadbolt is one of our favorites and we did a video reviewing the product, uh, how to install it. We've talked about how to set up the user codes and program it. We've talked about how to do a factory reset on that. If you want to see any of those videos, I'll put a link to those down below if that's what you're looking for. This is also a very budget friendly deadbolt. It's not a smart deadbolt, it's not controlled by the app, but it is electronic and allows you to use pin code to get into the property. You can pick these up now on Amazon for right around 89 bucks. I'll put a link to that product down below in case you're interested in getting it. Now, the way this deadbolt is supposed to function is obviously from inside the home, the thumb turn is supposed to lock and unlock the deadbolt. And you can see that this one is doing that beautifully. And once you are outside of the home, if you want to get in, you should be able to use a code turn the mechanical mechanism and unlock the deadbolt. This one also appears to be functionally correctly there. However, if you're outside the home and you hit this Schlage button, it's supposed to allow you to lock the lock, but this one will actually allow you to unlock the lock. So anyone outside of the home can hit that button and get into your house. Now this is not a problem with the lock. It is a problem with the installation of the lock. Now in the videos that I mentioned previously, there have been dozens and dozens of comments from people telling me my lock is broke, it's not operating correctly. When I hit the Schlage button, it unlocks. The other problem that they have when they install it is they might not be able to actually get it to lock all the way or unlock all the way. And the other interesting thing is when you're outside of the home, in order to get it to lock, because the Schlage button is not working, you actually have to use a code to lock it from the outside of the home. So it's behaving backwards. A code to lock, Schlage button to unlock, just the opposite of what it is supposed to be doing. All of those symptoms are because of one root problem with the installation of this lock. And let's dive down into that. Let me just take the back panel off. Now, here's the root cause of the problem. This arrow, when the bolt is retracted, this cam, that arrow on the cam should be pointed in the down position like this when the bolt is retracted. Okay, so when you're doing the install, the bolt is supposed to be retracted and the cam is supposed to be pointed down and that allows you to put in the two securing screws. If you do this with the bolt out, that's how you will get the symptom that I'm showing here where it behaves backwards. I'm going to give a little credit to Schlage here because um, they've actually made it very, very difficult to install these incorrectly now. Obviously, a number of them out there are installed incorrectly because I've got a number of comments on it, but they have little grooves in this cam now that line up with the screw head. So if I actually have the bolt in the retracted position, I wouldn't be able to put these screws in. They've improved the instructions tremendously from the way that they were first written. When they were first written, the correct way to install this was just sort of this little tiny little side note and it was easily missed. We're going to fix this lock right now so it behaves correctly. What I'm going to do is take these screws out. The correct way to install this is with the bolt retracted and then with the cam facing down in this position. Like that shown there. And I'm not gonna go through and put everything on here. I'm just gonna show you that this does indeed fix the problem. And again, you can see that when that bolt is retracted, the grooves in the cam line up and that's the only way I can get these screws in. And we'll just 
slide the faceplate on there. Now, if I'm outside of the home and I hit a code, I can indeed unlock the door. And if I'm on the outside of the home and I hit the Schlage button, nothing happens. I can no longer unlock my door. And with the door unlocked, the way that you would lock the door after you leave the home with the door unlocked is you hit the Schlage button and now you can lock the door. So that cam is very important when you're doing this install. Make sure that the cam is pointed down when the bolt is retracted in the door. That's how you fix this problem of the Schlage button unlocking the door without a user code. I'm Robert with Acme Locksmith. You've been watching Locksmith Recommended. Hey, if you like this video, smash the like button down below. Be sure to turn on the notifications so that you get alerted every time we have a new video. Thank you for watching Locksmith Recommended.